Hello everybody, welcome back. It's been a long time since I made any content at all. Um, I have not been doing anything for this channel for a while because I have not been playing any games, I have not been making any content, and just had too much going on. So, with the new updates for Enshrouded, I really wanted to get back into it. And I'm going to start here. I have been playing for a few days I've unlocked all of the village people so let me just show you all the village people so the normal craft people and then the assistants there's five assistants that you can unlock that the assistants like for example Fenrig Mills Jr. this guy he's a farmer so he can do the same stuff that Emily the farmer can do so you can have kind of like multiple bases with different people that can do things if you want. And then these regular villagers that are completely useless. But if you build a prison, it can be pretty fun. Um, so anyways, I unlocked all of them. And this is my first base. So this was my first house. So look on the map. See the uh, cinder vault in the bottom left there? That's the starting area. So I'm, I'm pretty much like... I'm, I'm pretty close to this, you know, the starting area, not that far away from it, um, considering how huge this map is. So over the last few days, I've been playing through a bunch of the new content that I haven't um, been able to check out yet. I've already been farming the dragon, so this marker up here, this is the mountain area, and this marker right here is the fell dragon, the final boss currently, and I made a home there, and that's what this video is about. I'm going to show you that, but before that, I want to show you all the way down here, below the Pillars of Creation, my first base area, I'm going to set that as a waypoint, because what we're going to do, I'm going to show you this first. So this is my first house. dogs when you pet the dogs and probably cats I haven't gotten a cat yet but it gives you pause touch it buffs you to pet the dogs so this is my house and then my vault area this is this was originally the area for my craft people and I moved them upstairs because I've been changing all of this around so my village people, I built like a barracks room. So this is where all my village people live. This used to be my Balthazar the Alchemist's lab. Changing that around. But I built an upstairs that's pretty sweet. So here's my upstairs. Uh oh, it's getting dark. Which will actually look pretty cool. Do 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 do. See I got a farm. I got chickens, goats, baby goats, baby bunnies. It's a baby bunny. We're going to wait for it to get dark, and then I'm going to show you everything I got around here. And just for this reason, because I like to spend time with my farm animals, I put a bed here. I knew I was gonna need that eventually. See, all oh, babies. Look at look at the baby deer. They're so cute. Baby goat. Yay, babies. Babies everywhere. Lots of food everywhere too. Yaks. Any more? Any any baby? Uh, there's a baby cow. Oh, I want to pet it. I don't want to upgrade it. There's a baby cow. Say look at it. I love the uh, farming. It's got ice in the trough. I love the farming that we get to do. It's so fun. So, anyways. I made Halloween Town over here. Here's my area for my craft people. I, I'm still a long ways off because I've been changing all of this around. But I gave my craft people a little village. They're not the brightest. They, see, they like to just run into walls and stuff. So hopefully their AI gets fixed. Get on the roof. 
get on the roof. Okay, I'm gonna jump on a pumpkin. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, you can see it. See right above my head there? You see that floating structure up there? That's where the final boss is, but that's that's what that's the home that I made up there all the way across the map. All the way across the map. Up here. Look at that. And this is what we're gonna try. Because I made this earlier uh, today. Took a couple of flame altars to build the stairs all the way up here from that mountain. But there's the boss. Yeah, he's a, he's a pain in the butt too, but once you know how to beat him, there's a few ways to cheese the fight pretty easily, so once you figure that out, you can farm him over and over pretty, pretty simple. But my home, my other home, hold on, I took away my waypoint. I'm going to set a waypoint. Look at this, look at this. All the way across the map. This is going to be fun. All the way across the map. I want to see if we can fly all the way to my home down there. the boost right off the bat you can you can start to see it see the glowing blue that glowing blue down there that's from my glowing blue blocks we're gonna see if we can fly across the entire map this is gonna be fun look at this all the way up here we're gonna fly all the way down we're gonna see if we can land on my on my home down there Crazy though. Look at that. Look at that view. You can see that sun temple to the left. You see all kinds of stuff. See that the black mire tree way over there on the right? This is crazy. I really wanted to see if I could do this. They're so high up. Hopefully you guys are interested in just watching this because it, it's going to take a while. We're going to be flying for a good minute. I was curious to see how far we could glide from the top of the world, basically. And I thought it would be a good test to see if I could fly from up there down to my home. Hopefully I don't run out of stamina. Crap. I should have <laughs> I should have refreshed my food. Oh no. <laughs> uh, my food's gonna run out before we get there. I, I really should have planned that better. We might have to redo this. That's not okay. Darn it. Why didn't anybody warn me? <laughs> I never pay attention to the duration I have left on my food. I like I never pay attention to it. I think I'm gonna make it. Now it's a race. That's gonna be nuts if I make it. <laughs> if I make this, it's gonna be so crazy. Oh no, my two, two of my foods just ran out. I think, I think they just ran out. I mean, it looks like they did. Ugh, well, we'll see. Do you think I'm gonna make it? Oh no, there goes one food. Crap. 
There goes the other. Okay, now they're they're definitely gone. Oh no, this is gonna be close. Oh my goodness, this is gonna be close. Do you think I'm gonna make it? This is nuts. I don't know. I think I think I'm gonna make it. I I do. I think I'm gonna make it easily. I think I'm still quite a ways. I think I'm still pretty high. Holy moly. And, and this house is, like, this area I built, it's already floating up really high, as it is. Oh my goodness. I can fly over my... Oh no, we're going to have to land. Whoa! Uh, I could have flown over it. That's crazy. Look at that. From the top of that mountain, you can see it still. From the top of that mountain... We were able to fly. You can see the dragon up there flying around if you look really hard. Alright, be honest. Who thought that I'd be able to make that? Who thought I'd be able to fly across the entire freaking map? From one home all the way to the other. That's so wild. Alright, let me know what you guys think. I'm going to end this video here because I really just wanted to focus on that for this one. And I'm kind of ecstatic. I think I might go back to the top of that mountain up there and like build something, I don't know, build something crazy up there. So <laughs> let me know what you guys uh, think about all this. Alright, have a good one.